Sending text messages and emailing your customers in All Data Manage Online is simple and efficient. You can also send reminders and general messages to specific customer groups with the Customer Relationship Manager feature, or CRM. Manage Online can send text and email messages directly to customers and we'll show you two ways to do that. The first way is text messaging straight from the work document. You can message the customer that their vehicle is ready for pickup, a simple welcome message, or just that the work has been started on their vehicle. Now this is a great tool to keep your customer informed about the status of their vehicle and it'll only take you a few clicks. So from the work document, click the cell phone icon. Now this icon shows up here because we defined this as a preferred contact method for this customer on the new customer screen. Let's check that out. Okay, back to our work document. Select a predefined message that you've already created, like the ones here, or write a new message like this one. Click send. Okay, now the message has been sent and we'll click OK. And you're done. And within seconds, your customer will receive that text message. Now Manage Online sends outgoing text messages only. So when writing your messages, make sure to include your shop's contact information to give your customers an easy way to respond. Now creating and setting up these messages is very simple and you can click up here to view the tutorial for setup. Okay, that was from the work document. The second way is to email or text message your customers from the CRM. You can message specific groups of customers based on the type of communication such as reminders or deferred work and customers based on the type of vehicles that they owned, last visit or search for a particular customer by name. So click reports, customer relationship manager and select a type. For this example, we're going to email all of our customers with outstanding deferred work. So we'll select a date from and a date to. Or leave these dates blank and we'll display all of our deferred work customers. But we're just going to show this short list of deferred work customers for this past month. OK, we'll select the contact method and the message type. And we'll select the customers that we want to contact. For this one, we'll just click Ashley Ashley and deselect the others. And we'll click send. Now a pop-up message will appear, we'll click OK, and you're done. And your customers will receive an email message, something like this, about their outstanding deferred work. Now setting up this messaging feature with reminder types and messages is really quick and simple. So to view that tutorial, just click up here.